getting craft this honey mask. Subscribe and hit that bell button to join the Bright Army and be part of the Bright and Early Squad. Welcome back, Brights. I'm Sabrina Bright, and today on Terrorite Games, we're playing more Bee Swarm Simulator, and we're about to get the honey mask. That's right, we're getting the honey mask and another star amulet. Will it be gold or will it be diamond? I don't know, stay tuned to see. But before we get into it, let's do a bright like spike. Everybody hit that like button. Let's see if we can get this to two, 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 two likes, because that's cool. Smash that like button! That's so many likes! So last time I played, I asked you guys if you wanted me to do a video continuing the Christmas quest with the bear over here. And of course, most of you said yes. And a lot of you've been asking for more bee swarms. So I did one quest between the last video and now. So I still have a ton of quests to do with bee bear. But today we're actually going to be getting the honey mask. That is right. If you didn't know, the honey mask is sold in the Ace shop. It's not as good as the gummy, the gummy bear mask or gummy mask, whatever it's called but that thing's gonna be so tough to get but for now this should help us get there you know so let's go ahead and see what we need we need 100 million honey okay i have 324 million which by the way i entered the game yesterday without knowing that there's gonna be this special thing and i was talking to onet the creator of the game and he was saying like he never expected beast form to be uh, so big and he's so grateful and he's giving us presents and there's like times two conversion pollen and times two conversion rate for the next two days so i was pretty stoked about that and i started saving up a bunch of honey because i had like none so now I have 324 million and we are we just need to go get some treats We need basically 10,000 treats for this and then we'll be able to buy it So we're gonna go do that first and then we should be close to having enough to get the gold amulet But I wonder can we get more gifted bees? I have 21 gifted bees You need 30 to get the diamond amulet the star amulet. Uh, so I don't know We'll see if we can get that or not, but I'm going to go ahead and buy 10,000 treats here we go Ready? 100 million honey is how much this costs. We are treat rich now. Let's see if I have 10,068 treats. Holy moly, that's a lot of treats. I still don't have three of my bees raised to a level nine. I have two, I have one and then two are like getting close, but uh, that's one of my mother bear quests I haven't finished yet. And my star journey quest i'm still working on the uh, star journey number three because of the blue bo boost tokens i have 5.676 out of 7500 tokens so i'm kind of close to finishing that one and i started helping bbm forgot what that stands for the little like guy that we were talking to in the last episode where i couldn't find him and then we finally found him to believe but yeah i'm doing like a quest for him and now i just needed to deliver two more presents and i'll finish that first quest so anyway let's go ahead and <laughs> i cannot believe this we're gonna get this it requires 10,000 treats well 9999 treats 50 oil 25 enzymes and five gold eggs now i actually did have to buy some of the gold eggs with robux because i'm like how the heck am i supposed to get gold eggs i don't know how you're supposed to get gold eggs otherwise like if you've already hatched them or used them tell me how you get gold eggs without buying without robux i i don't know i know that i used to get them by finishing quests but i got them and used them so i don't know how you're supposed to even get this mask without basically using robux but anyway at least it was 200 robux it wasn't like too bad per egg let's go ahead and craft this honey mask oh my gosh it's that easy whoa holy moly guys look at me this is awesome <laughs> i did not expect it to look like this it's like giant and you can still see my face through it it's actually adorable i look amazing so we have the belt from the ace shop and now we have the mask we just need the guards which are really expensive did you see the guards are 200 million honey each and then we also don't have enough ingredients now for them but oh my gosh i actually i could get this with the uh the two times pollen and two times conversion for the next day i could save up pretty easily and get these guards that would be pretty epic i don't know if i could do it before i upload this video but i'm definitely gonna work on it so i forgot to read you guys what you actually get from this mask basically it gives <laughs> this handsome mask is guaranteed to bring satisfaction into your life <laughs> The hat brings you plus 30% pollen from bees, plus 26% instant conversion, wow, plus 30% damage reduction, plus 12% bee ability rate, plus 120% luck 
Oh my gosh. Plus 150% honey from tokens and plus 60 conversion amount. That is OP. So we are doing great right now. <laughs> oh, it's nighttime. Oh my gosh, there's the... There they go. And the next thing we're gonna do is I actually have a bunch of royal jelly and I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can get any more gifted bees because if I can get to 30 gifted bees, we could just go ahead and save up for the diamond ant, I mean, not ant, the diamond amulet, the star one. But the thing about that is I have no idea how much it actually costs because when I looked in the shop, it just told me how many bees I had out of how many is required. It didn't tell me how much it, it costs. So I might not be able to, actually get it even if I got more gifted bees but we're gonna go ahead and just see what happens and use some of my royal jellies so I have 90 royal jellies I have seven star jellies what it's first would be even a random gift so we can get seven right there but I don't know if it's gonna be something we have already what do we have that's a repeating bee over here a hasty bee that's given in a non gifted hasty bee uh, so we're gonna go ahead and use a star jelly on this hasty bee and hopefully we get something we don't have here we go <gasps> Gifted diamond bee! Wait, don't I already have that? Oh my gosh, I think I- I do! Ah, I already have that! That's no fair! Oh my gosh! Alright guys, we're gonna have to use another star jelly on that because you can't stack gifted bees. Here we go. Gifted bomber bee! Wait, I don't think- Oh, we do. Why are you doing this to me, game? We already have that! <laughs> oh no! Whoa. Gifted demon bee? I already have that too! What the heck? It's not fair! <laughs> Seriously, why are you doing this to me, game? I have three of those now. <laughs> we have four star jellies left. Let's go see what we get now. <gasps> we got gifted shocked bee. I don't think we have that. I think I actually got rid of shocked bee because it wasn't like helping me out that much. But yeah, yay, we finally got something we don't have. Yay. So now we gotta choose the next bee that I'm gonna make gifted. Who will it be? Bee. That was not supposed to be a joke or anything. Let me go ahead real quick and see what Frosty Bee does for us. I'm not sure if it's really helping us all that much. So in case we lose that bee, I don't want it to be like something that was important. So Frosty Bee just only has one attack. So I kind of want to have more attacks so I can do like a crazy ant challenge and stick bug challenge and get the stump snail. So it only has one attack. Its energy is 35, its speed is 14, and it's gifted high. Oh, it gives a blue boost and a blue bomb token. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put a star jelly on it. I hope this isn't a mistake, but we really need to get more gifted bees. So I have three star jellies left. Let's go ahead and put it on frosty bee. We got a gifted rascal bee. Oh, wait, do I have that? No, I don't think I do. Yes. Oh my gosh, that was a good call on my part. All right, so we got gifted rascal bee. So now we have this regular rascal bee, but we're gonna put a star jelly on. Dude, we are doing things. Please be Gifted stubborn bee. Wait. Oh my gosh, it's one that I don't have. Dude, I'm getting... It's that luck from the honey mask, guys. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna put the last star jelly on this stubborn bee that's not gifted. Here we go, ready? Gifted hasty bee. Do we... Yeah, we already have that. All right, so we're just gonna... We're gonna go ahead and put a regular royal jelly on this until we get a gifted bee and hope that it's something we don't have. Oh, wait, we just got frosty bee back. I don't know, should I just keep it? No, let's keep going. We want more gifted bees. Ooh, though, lion bee. I love Lion Bee. Um, Lion Bee really helps us with attack. This is a tough call, Brights. This is a really tough call, but we're gonna keep going. Oh, that hurt. We just really need a gifted bee. Come on. <gasps> gifted Looker Bee. Wait, we already have Gifted Looker Bee. No! Six royal jellies left, Brights. This is it. We're about to be left off with Rad Bee. <laughs> All right. So I do have one star egg. But the thing about this is I'd have to evict a bee and start it leveling it up from zero. I don't know. This is a hard choice, Brights. This is a hard, hard choice. But we do have two of these and we're trying to get as many gifted bees as we can. So I think, I think I'm gonna do it. I don't know. Oh, yeah, okay. Ah, I'm scared. All right, we're buying an eviction. This is it. We're evicting a bee. We're getting another gift to bee that I don't already own. And I wonder how many bees that's gonna be that's gifted. Probably not 30 though. We, we made some great progress though. Let me go ahead and we're gonna evict. Oh, which one's less? Let's see. This one is 30,999 and 
This one is, oh wow, this one's almost a level eight. Yeah, we're gonna evict this one over here. So goodbye, Rad B. What bee will we get? I'm actually so excited for this. Here we go. Gifted Shy Bee. It's a legendary. That's awesome. This talented bee doesn't like so to socialize. It just wants to work and be left alone. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yay. All right, let's go ahead and go see how many we actually have because it's easier just to go there and see how many I have than to try to count all my gifted bees. So we're gonna go here and let's see. I have 25 out of 30. Oh my gosh, it's so close. So close. I only need five more. I actually have 883 tickets. That could buy me a star treat soon because it costs a thousand tickets for one. So if I just get some more royal jellies and or maybe star jellies from something, maybe I'll get that like as a gift or something, then I have a chance to get that. Otherwise, I got to save up 250 million honey for the gold one. So I think we did a lot so far. I'm pretty happy with... Oh no, there's a honey storm. Yes. I'm pretty happy with getting the mask and getting more gifts gifted bees definitely gonna help us out because they're all gonna have stuff that helps us the gifted bees the stats are gonna help a lot so here's what i'm working on obviously i'm trying to get that diamond star amulet if i can't i'm gonna get the gold one but trying to get that i'm also trying really hard to go and upgrade all of my badges to like where it turns blue. Let me just move my camera real quick. So my badge is over here. When they're blue, it means like, I think we're master when it's blue. So I already mastered the strawberry badge, the bamboo badge, but I'm, I'm really close to the pineapple one and I'm really close with the sunflower one and the bee ability one. Like I'm like really close on a lot of these. So it's definitely something I'm working toward here. And the pine tree one, I'm the really close on. So. These are going to help us with, you know, making honey and pollen a lot faster. We have more gifted bees now and I'm working on my quest. So we're going to finish with the present quest and we're also going to go over and finish the bees miss beatdown where I need to kill one more spider. So let's go do that right now. Actually, I'm going to switch back real quick to my other tool. All right, so all we have to do is get one more spider. There it is. And then we go go talk to bee bear again. And I think we're going to get a present. So when you get a present, you bring it to a bear. Yay, the shy bee leveled up. Yeah, my shy bee is actually uh, starting from scratch. I forgot. All right, so we just finished that quest. So we're going to go ahead and talk to bear bee. Bee bear? Bear bee? I don't remember. <laughs> Let's see what he has to say. Bee bear. Deck the halls with royal jelly. Fa la 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 la. Put it in basic bee's belly. Fa la 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 la. <laughs> oh gosh. Now everyone's on the same page. And look, the next present is coming. Deliver it to a friend, exchange it for a surprise. Then quickly head back. We've got much more to do. Okay, so we just received a ticket, a present, and some honey. So basically, here's what we have to do. I've already given one to Black Bear. I forgot what I got from Black Bear. Hmm, I got something really great. And I've already given one, I think, to Brown Bear, but I kind of want to give one to like the Stick Bug or maybe Polar Bear or Science Bear. Hmm, I don't know. Should I go to the Stick Bug? I'm going to try the Stick bu Bug and see if it lets me. Tisk, tisk, tisk. Nope. Okay. Oh, we need the translator. So basically to get translators, you have to finish Science Bear quests. And I haven't done that yet. So we're just going to go talk to... Hmm, I think I already gave one to Polar Bear, actually. I don't remember. <laughs> I gave two presents so far, guys. And I don't remember who it was. I remember one was Black Bear, but I can't remember if I gave one to Brown Bear or Polar Bear. Can I give one to this man over here? Bubble, Bubble Bee Man? Let's see if we can give one to Bubble Bee Man. No. Okay. All right. Let's just go ahead and give one to Panda Bear. We haven't given one to Panda Bear yet. Oh yeah, Beesmas, what you've got here? Wow, automatic monster respawn timer. Sends a notification everywhere or every time a werewolf respawns. That's a Beesmas gift I'll actually use. Thanks, I appreciate it. Oh, and here's something for you. Now let's get back to work. The bugs don't break Beemus. Okay, so we got 15 singers, 10 tickets, Rage Bee Jelly, Bamboo Field, Boost Buff times 4, and 5,000 Honey. All right, so we're going to the Bamboo Field, guys. Oh my gosh, we're about to... I gotta change into my other tool for the blue pollen. We're about to make so much honey. 
So I'll be right back when my buff is over. So it has 14 minutes. So I'll be back in about 15 minutes. I just realized I never went back and talked to Bee Bear about the next quest. So let's go do it just in case it has something to do with blue pollen or the bamboo field or anything having to do with what I'm doing right now. During Bee's Mist, we string up beautiful colorful lights. They twinkle and glow and fill us with a sense of wonder and awe. To get the full effect, it's best to go see them at night. As a small cub, before I became a magical Bee Bear, my parents would drive us through the rich neighborhoods every year just to see the lights. It's the most spectacular cost efficient form of entertainment. Ho ho ho. The fireflies that appear at night put on a similar show all year long. And if you chase them away, you can earn yourself some moon charms. Next, collect 20,000 pollen from the bamboo field, 10,000 pollen from blue flower field, and five moon charm to tokens and deliver that present. Wow. All right. So we already delivered the present and I'm glad I went and talked to them because now we're doing, we're doing the bamboo field. So yay. And I already finished. Wow. That was quick. Holy moly. Let's go ahead and find the fireflies. Oh, look how fast I'm finishing this one. And I'm done with that one too. Oh my goodness. I'm probably gonna miss the fireflies. Let's get these. Oh no, I got hurt. Yay. All right, we got one. Come on, come on. Give me these. I need pineapples too. All right, we got two. I think that's all we're gonna be able to get. So I'm gonna need three more moon charms. But if a moon sprout pops up, then we are good to go. Oh, hey, would you look at that? Got three. That's it. I got three out of it. Still pretty good. The fireflies are coming back out. It's time for me to finish Bee Bear's quest and get two more moon charms. This is going to be a breeze. They're going up here. Follow the fireflies. Come on. Oh, of course there's a werewolf. All right. We got one. Now we only need one more. But I'm going to try to get as many as I can because why not? Dude, there's just... They're everywhere. There's moon charms everywhere. All right, so we finished, and now we're gonna go ahead and talk to Bee Bear again. Hopefully we get another present. I think I need to finish Science Bear's quest to get a translator, and I still need to get just some strawberry and pineapple tokens before I finish that one. I'm trying the best I can, but I wanna be able to give a present to Stick Bug because we get 333 million, no, 33 million, 333,033. 333. I don't know. It's all threes, okay? But we get a lot of honey by giving a present to Stickbug, and I need 250 million honey to go get the gold star amulet. So I think I've kind of made my mind up I'm gonna be getting that. Two more quests and the next present will be finished. All right. The festive bee just loves fruit. When you own one, they occasionally grant treats, including strawberries, blueberries, and, and pineapples to everyone on your server, including yourself. For that reason, fruit salad is a staple dessert of beesmiths. Oh yes, put it all in a bowl and sprinkle it with honey. Leave some out for me when you do go to bed. Ho ho ho. For this next quest, collect 55,000 pollen from the pineapple patch, 35,000 pollen from the strawberry field, and 15 blueberry tokens. Not bad. And plus, I, I need to get strawberry and pineapple tokens anyway for my science bear quest. So, so we're doing two things at once. So let's go ahead to the pineapple patch and get to work. This takes so much grinding in this game. So many tasks. It's never ending. All right. So I just finished a bunch of quests. I finished the festive fruit salad quest, the polar bear quest, and the brown bear quest. Oh my goodness, I'm on a roll. So let's talk to Bee Bear real quick. Oh, the beetles outside are fry full, but the sprouts are so delightful. These are so funny. One more quest and the next present will be complete. Yes. All right, so what is the quest? Each and every home needs a bee's mist tree during bee mist. We picked out a beautiful evergreen tree or an artificial alternative. <laughs> Take it home, wrap it in lights, and decorate it with a short, delightful ornaments. Ho, 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 they're the centerpiece of bee's mist. To complete this present, I'll first need your help scouting the perfect bee's mist tree. Collect 100,000 thousand pollen from the pine tree forest defeat two of those naughty naughty werewolves oh great oh those are the, that's it that's all i have to do oh my goodness that's awesome also there was a hidden present behind the polar bear which i got off camera a few days ago so sorry about not showing that on camera but it's there and there's two other areas where you can get a present as well i found another hidden present it's in the ace shop above here. So we just got ourselves our fifth present to deliver. That way we can finish one of these quests. So I think I'm actually going to deliver this present to on it. So let's go ahead and talk to him. I'm pretty sure there's another hidden present somewhere, but I'm not sure where, where it is. I have a gift for you. Let's see if I can give it. Oh, can I not? How do I give it to him? 
I guess I can't give it to him. I thought I could. I really have to finish that quest for Science Bear. I need 60 more strawberry tokens and pineapple tokens. I'll be right back after I get those. Hopefully we'll get some sprouts. Guys, I finally finished Science Bear's first quest. Hopefully we get a translator. I don't know how many I have to finish, but that took quite a while for me to finish that single quest. So I think we might need to get three separate translators. One for Bucko V, one for Gifted Riley B, and one for the Stick Bug, I think. So let's go ahead. Enjoy the lights I strung up. Give present to Science Bear. No, I just want to talk to Science Bear. Fascinating. So there are 22 different types of bees. Ah, finally, detail broke it down. I'm not going to read all these to you guys just because it's going to take this video's getting long. But here we go. We're able to convert 25% more pollen and honey attack. Time. That's amazing. Oh my gosh, my my conversion and efficiency bonus is 450 percent. That's amazing extra reward I'd like you to have one of these a bottle of oil. Wait, so did I get it? No Ugh, What the heck? I didn't get a translator. Science Bear is telling me all about the stuff in the blender and what you can combine to make. Earn 15 badges, craft 10 ingredients with the blender. Create 3,333,333 pollen from a pumpkin patch. Collect it from the what the heck? Oh my gosh, you got me doing so much work. I thought I was gonna be able to get a translator. Oh, I'm sad. I'm very saddened. Well, I only need 30, 30 million more honey so I could get the amulet and we do have a present so i'm gonna go ahead and look it up and see who's gonna give me the best gift back in return for my present all right we're gonna go ahead and give our present to mother bear give present to mother bear oh that's a wonderful surprise what could it possibly be a lovely framed photo of me and my cubs how incredible incredibly sweet of you Ooh, we got tickets strawberries blueberries sunflower seeds pineapples and a five buff on the dandelion field that's awesome but i need to switch my tool so this is gonna help us get to 250 million honey pretty quickly well we just passed 250 million honey and we are ready to go ahead and get the gold star amulet it's taken me so long because for a while i didn't play beast form simulator so i got really really behind but we're actually really close to getting the diamond one, but for now I'm gonna go ahead and get the gold one because, you know, I have 25 out of 30 gifted bees and it's gonna be kind of hard from here to get the last five. This will help me a lot in the long run. So I'm gonna go ahead and purchase this and now we have a gold star amulet, which gives us more container space, better conversion rate. So we didn't even have a, a different conversion rate. There's more stuff here. Plus 3% bee ability rate, plus 38% white pollen and 11% just pollen overall. That's literally amazing. This is going to help us out so much. Oh my gosh. So we got the honey mask and we got a gold star amulet. I am looking good, Bright. I just got to get that diamond one. So I guess I'm going to just keep working on my quests. It's going to take me a while. I'm going to get the rest of my presents. I definitely have to finish this uh, science bear quest because they're going to give me, it's going to give me translators so that I can talk to gifted Bucko B, gifted Riley B, and stick bug and i think you need to get three different translators and when you give it to them they take it and it's gone from your inventory so i gotta go get those it's gonna take quite a while i'm quite behind but i am very happy with what we got done in this episode we have so many gifted bees this is insane but i'm gonna have to call it a night here or i'm gonna be playing this for the next week because i can't stop playing it's so addicting if you're new make sure you do hit that subscribe button to join the bride army don't forget to turn on notifications so you don't miss when videos come out and check out some other videos you may have missed over there. Thanks so much for watching guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye